Time to go to the carriage house. There's one neighbor that's really upset with Jack, with him riding at the motorcycle. Is there a problem? No. You're harassing me. I'm not harassing you. This Karen has threatened to call the cops on me and sue me and do a bunch of other things. Thank you, Karen. <laughs> Now, my next guest is a neighbor who says she's being harassed by Jack. Uh, Rachel joins us via phone from New York. Rachel, how are you doing? I'm good. How are you? Well, I'm well, and thank you for joining us. And uh, I'm sorry that you've been harassed in this way. What do you have to say about this? You know, I think that he should be grateful that I haven't gotten him arrested. I haven't gotten... Mm -hmm. A restraining order arrested, against right? him. You know, I don't think he realizes that the consequences could be a lot worse than what they have been. Uh -huh. I mean, I understand that, you know, he's doing this for YouTube and his friends and whatever, but, you know, there comes a time where it really starts to affect someone else's life, and I think that he just really needs to realize that. Right. So enough's enough and too much is too much, right? Exactly. Well, there's two sides to every story, and I think you guys are kind of focusing just on her side, but... Have you ever apologized to Rachel? I'll, I'm 100% willing to apologize to her right now. Rachel, I am sorry for uh, uh, riding my dirt bike by her house, but I also could have posted her face on the internet also because I wasn't on her property or anything like okay, that. What, we're, I'm looking for the apology in there. Oh, I'm just uh, saying, I'm just saying like my side of the story as well because I'm just saying like you said she could have called the cops on me also, but I could have put her face out on the internet, but I chose not to do that because I don't want it to have effect on her life either. So I'm just saying. I don't I think sorry. that he knows how to give someone a genuine apology. I, okay, but how would I the word apology? it? I'm like trying my best here. I don't know how to word it. You you should be acknowledging my feelings. That's right, what an right. apology is about. Not the fact, not the actions that you point. committed to get me to this point. You should be. I'm sorry that I inflicted these emotions on you and I interfered with your life and your family and I it's wasted little, your time yeah, and that's what you should be sorry good. for, not what you did on the videos to get YouTube views. I'm sorry for uh, <clears throat> disrespecting you. Rachel, can we, could I bring Jack to your house one day to apologize? Yeah, I'm down. I'll bring you a gift basket yeah. and some toys for your kids. How about that? Okay. That I'd like to do. Yeah, I'll take him on a shopping spree. It's not about. It's I'm not, not about saying it's about you guys are just constantly to trying. I'm trying to be it's nice. It's about being genuine. Oh my I get god, that. I'm being attacked for everything. I feel like. I know. And then it was just you, hard to put you into play the victim and say, "I'm getting picked on here. I'm getting picked on here." But you don't mind. But I was trying my best, people. and everybody was just picking on me for like everything I do. You know, but like, all right, I'm used to it. Whatever. Well, Rachel, yeah. I, I certainly don't perceive you as being a Karen, and I, I think you've been very gracious to not. Uh, call the police on him, and you didn't because obviously oh, she didn't. She you're a, okay. you're a mom, and so you had some uh, compassion here. And uh, thank you for weighing in today and and giving Jack an opportunity to speak to you. Thank you. Hey, do you have a story or question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what it is. You might end up right here on the show.